So if you know me, <clears throat> I'm a big proponent <clears throat> on having uh, or talking to clients and athletes about protein and why most people don't consume enough protein. And it's probably the one, one of the main reasons why most people can't add muscle. <clears throat> um, and they overeat because they under eat protein, which helps keep you very satisfied for a long time, especially the three sources or three types of protein that I think are the best for muscle growth, repair, just overall, you know, just health benefits. So first one is going to be eggs. Uh, eggs has a ton of protein. You got to eat the whole egg. So don't just eat the egg whites. Um, one trick you can do is just have like maybe two eggs and then put some egg whites in addition to the two eggs that you're eating. So you actually increase the protein. Then you can throw in whatever else you want to put in, like vegetables or whatever else. <clears throat> it's a great breakfast. You should probably have it like every day. <clears throat> uh, my second s suggestion is some type of beef, um, whatever you want to call it, red meat. Uh, I mean, I can go on about the, the, the amount of vitamins, the amount of nutrients that you get from eating uh, red meat. Um, it is very satisfying and is a complete protein, um, as many of you probably already know. And then you can add, then the third one could be really anything else, like any type of poultry, fish. Uh, so like chicken, fish, ham, um, you, you can do like dairy, like milk, uh, whey protein. Those are great sources as well. Uh, you know, casein is another one. This is kind of goes in that last third category. Casein is really important because if you have casein before you go to bed, you can get a prolonged uh, source of protein while you sleep and repair your body at night. Um, there's actually a lot of research on how casein is very helpful for um, repair in the night and there is <clears throat> um, how it's very beneficial to take it at night um, because it takes a lot longer to digest. Um, a little bonus is I know some people that probably follow me or maybe you're watching this video uh, don't eat animal based proteins. So I would say just get some type of plant based if you can, uh, make sure that it is minimally processed, doesn't have a bunch of junk in it as far as like a ton of ingredients. I mean, at the end of the day, just make sure there's at least 25 grams of protein per a serving. Anywhere between 20 and 25 grams. If it's less than that, it's a waste of money. So, I <clears throat> uh, hope this helps. If you have questions, one other suggestions on protein, how you should do it, how you should eat it, whatever, uh, comment below or DM me protein. And I'd be more than happy to help. Peace. Have a good day.